I'm here at work. And it's pretty nice outside, but it's kind of chilly. And this video will consist of a mini hunt at Target and Figs and Sneakers Part 2 Wrestling Edition. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you for the love and support as always. But more importantly, love you guys. All right, peace. All right, I got the New Day paired out with my Kobe 9 Brazils. And just to let you guys know that these three elites right here, the New Day, will be in my top 10 of 2020. And I got these Kobe's from Shoe Palace in Plaza Bonita in San Diego. I forgot what year, but these are one of my favorite sneakers and the design of it looks really dope because they're different from one another and they to me they remind me of i think it's the what the i'm not sure if you're a sneakerhead let me know in the comments if it's called what the the sneakers that have different designs on the, of each shoe but this is the new day with the kobe 9 brazils next week i saw mojo Joe paired up with my sport blue threes and we all know that Jordans, they drop on Saturdays, and these pair right here, they just happened to drop on my birthday. And my birthday is August 16th, and when I found out that these were coming out on my birthday on a Saturday, I had to get them. I didn't get them right away. I had to buy them from my cousin for retail, but this is Samoa Joe with Sport Blue 3s. I got Kurt Hawkins, aka Brian Myers. I'm not sure if Brian Myers is his first name, but I forgot. But I got him paired up with my Air Max 270s, and these are one of the most comfortable sneakers that I have in my collection that I wear on my hunts. And for some odd reason, I love the New York Mets colorway on Nikes. I don't know what it is about them, but I have another pair of Air Maxes, and I believe they're Air Max 93, and they're the same colorway. But this is Kurt Hawkins with my Air Max 270s. We got Alexa Bliss paired up with my Vapor Maxes. And when Nike first introduced the Vapor Max line, it was weird to me because I've never seen the bottom of the sneaker look like that. But when I got them, I tried it on. I was surprised of how comfortable they are. Now they're one of the most comfortable Nikes that I do have in my collection. And I wear these a lot on my hunts and I highly recommend them. And this is Alexa Bliss with my Nike Paper Maxes. We got Mandy Rose and Sheldon Benjamin paired up with my Reebok questions. And these were Allen Iverson's signature sneakers. And when these came out, I believe it was in 96, not this pair, but there were two different colorways, a red pair and a blue pair. And I regret not picking them up when I had the chance to, but these black and gold ones, they're fine with me because they're the colorway of my high school, Oxen Hill High. And this is Mandy Rose and Sheldon Benjamin with the Reebok questions. And next we got the Phenom, The Undertaker. Thank you, Taker, for 30 years in the WWE. And he's paired up with my Jordan 21s, and I believe it was 2006 when I got these. I just came back from San Diego for my cousin's wedding. And I used to live in San Diego for half a year. I thought I could do the whole school thing, but I couldn't, and plus I was homesick. And when I first saw these, I really thought it was really dope. And I think, if I'm not mistaken, Bentley, they're the one that inspired the Jordan brand to designed this but i'm not sure i forgot what's the inspiration be behind these jordans but this is the undertaker with jordan 21s all right i'm gonna talk you about my house and they got the music blasting they do got cap from the joe picks it wave they got mystique wolverine domino and they do got spider gwen and miles from the Venom Pool Wave, there's another cap. There's the Magneto and Professor X two pack and they do got a promo. Buy one, get one 50% off on all these brands. And let's see what else they got. They do got the new Spidey. 
but gonna pass and for multiverse this is what they got all right this is what they got for elites there's a kofi bobby fish Daniel Bryan, Ultimate Warrior. There's Craig Dimer Valentine. Craig Maverick. And that'll be it for Elites for Black Series. They got Han. The Hoth Trooper and Princess Leia. And oh, um Pimp Trooper Santa. And like that'll be it. And this is really dope that Hasbro's putting soft goods. But that'll be it. And if you have the vintage wave, it looks like they just restock. Yeah, it seems like they just got a shipment in. And if I see anything else. I'll let you guys know. All right, I'm at Target at Brandywine, and wow, nothing really for Marvel Legends. I just got this the Magneto and Professor X two pack. Old Man Logan and Old Man Hawkeye and Squirrel Girl. That's not the tag for it. And let's see what else they got. Robots. Nothing really. From multiverse. Ooh. First time seeing Batman Earth 1, Earth 32, and Earth 44. And oh, time is swing. Really dope see new figs here here's the whole portion of the video and i didn't buy no figs from the hunt i did pick up a couple books and as you guys could see here i've been picking up a few comic books lately more than figs and ever since third eye comics opened in waldorf i've been going there probably i'd say twice a week and let me just show you a few of the books that i picked up this is a graphic novel of Thanos. Thanos wins. There's the back. Sorry about that glare. And this stack right here are all Alex Ross timeless variants. I'm not gonna go through all of them. I'm just gonna show you some. No Spider-Man. Here's Thor. Black Panther. Uh, let's see what else. Daredevil, Ghost Rider, here's all of Fantastic Four, here's Cyclops and Colossus, and the next stack are going to be Marvel as well. And I did just finish Carnage, Absolute Carnage. Really dope book, highly recommend. And probably my favorite that I picked up so far would be the Thor run. And I'm basically caught up. Venom number one. Wolverine. Black, white, and blood. Right here are a stack of DC and image. Here's Batman 102 and 103. Justice League Odyssey number one. Punchline number one. Three Jokers. This one's a really dope book. Crossover. 
It's from Image. And here's Spawn 311. And Snake Eyes. And I did buy a short box. And what I'm doing is. Well, let me try to get in frame. That's a little bit better, but I had old comic books laying around. They weren't in the best condition, so I decided to cut some of the pages and tape them on here. And I do need more tape. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to tape it right there. Is one side. Is another side and another one. There you go. And the top of the box. I'm trying to think of what I could put. I'm not sure if I'm uh, at stickers or other comic book pages. That's my little project that I'm doing. And let me just fix my phone. Ah, anyways. Oh yeah. Oops, I did show that one. Um, These are the books that I picked up. Finally picked up Batman 101. Now I could read 102 and 103. Justice League Odyssey number two. And the cover is pretty dope. It's a foil cover. As you can see, you got Dark Side, Cyborg, Ezreal, Starfire, and I believe her name is Jessica Cruz. And even the back, it is hollow. And I thought that was pretty dope. And the rest of the books. Oh, there's a few more. These are going to be, there's four Alex Ross Timeless Variant, She-Hulk, Medusa, Spider-Woman, I think that's her name, I forgot, and Shang-Chi. And today is Wednesday, and, I, and it is new comic book day, I did pick up. I make boys cry from Absolute Comics Group. Sorry about that glare. And I picked up Scumbag 1 and 2, both from Image. But this was my haul. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you for the love and support as always. But more importantly, love you guys. All right, peace.